In a stunning twist tonight, drop the hammer. Um, nope. David DePap, the man in this newly released body cam video showing the violent October attack on Paul Pelosi, the former speaker's husband, is speaking out for the first time publicly since his arrest. Hi, how you doing? The call happened just hours on, after the man? release of the video. NBC News has not been able to independently verify the audio. Now that you all have seen the body cam footage, have an important message for everyone in America. You're welcome. According to KTVU, DePap called their reporter who had reached out to him months ago from the San Francisco County Jail. What is going on right now? At one point, the alleged attacker apologizing for not inflicting more pain. Investigators have previously said DePap had other high profile targets. In a police interview released on Friday, DePap told investigators he wanted to take the former speaker hostage and talk to her. If she told the truth, I'd never go stop here. Since Nancy Pelosi wasn't home, DePap shared why he struck Paul instead. You stop me from going after evil, you will take the punishment instead. DePap has pleaded not guilty to attempted murder and other charges. There's no question that DePap's attorney is just reeling from this phone call, but candidly, it happens more often than you think that the client sinks their own case with a phone call from jail. On Friday, Congresswoman Pelosi said she will not watch the video of the attack. I won't be making any more statements about this case as it proceeds, except to again thank people and inform them of Paul's progress. The PAPS public defender did not return our request for comment, but has previously said he believes his client cannot get a fair trial with the release of the body cam video. Jose? Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.